So here's a short little Bath and Body Works slash Body Shop haul. Um, some things that I got in. Um, I always stock up on my soaps from soaps from Bath and Body Works. They smell so good, and the 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 design on the bottles is so cute. I love them, and so every season they come out with some new ones. Usually, whenever I do <laughs> these videos, my nails look real nice. My thumb, my thumbnails are gone. My acrylic, um, my thumbs are gone. Um, but I had to cut them down because I haven't had my nails done since the beginning of February. Um, I would have gotten them done again, but the coronavirus happened, and I haven't left my house all all March, basically, slash the end of February. So they're not gonna be looking real cute when I like bring the bottles up to the camera, but it is what it is. Okay. So the first soap is this one here. It's so cute. It's got a little bunny on it. Spring has sprung. And usually on the side, or no, okay, it's on the back. So this one has um, crisp linen, lavender, sea salt, and fresh air breeze made with vitamin E, shea extract, aloe, and essential oils. This next one here is Right Meow. Super cute. And um, apple, okay, so this one, yeah, linen and lavender kind of says like on the top here. And then this one says apple hibiscus. So apple, nectar, hibiscus, and sweet orange. Ooh, I like that. Up next we have lavender marshmallow. I just love the sticker for this. I guess that one, okay. Lavender, vanilla, marshmallow, and warm amber. And I bought 10, I believe. Um, Happy Easter. Sweet Bunny Berry. So on the back it says sparkling raspberry candy petals and crystallized sugar. So that sounds nice. But when I was a little kid, I always used to love I mean, pretty much every holiday, I love the decor that they have, but Easter was always so cheerful and colorful and just like all the pastels. I loved all the pastels. I just love the Easter imagery. I'm not a religious person, so it doesn't have any religious significance to me, but I celebrate the shit out of the commercial side of holidays. So we have your Rexcellent Blue Ocean Waves. I love anything dinosaur. Whenever I found out I was pregnant, I was so excited because I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna buy dinosaur everything for this baby. And so it says, creamy sandalwood, salty ocean breeze, and lemon zest. I just bit my tongue. Next one here is some bunny loves you instead of a little donut. Sprinkled donut, and it's got buttercream, milk, and sweet vanilla. Blueberry crumble. I mean, I'm so excited about every single one of these things because I mean, they're just, they're so springy. It's just so nice, I love it. All right, so this has got fresh blueberries, brown sugar glaze, and dash of cinnamon. I'm kind of worried about the sound. I tried to listen back to the last video that I did about, um, <laughs> about the coronavirus, like from my perspective, basically. I'm using a microphone, but I don't know if I'm using it right. It's like plugged in to my, the lightning port and my iPhone, but it didn't sound any better because my, my, my videos have been really, like the volume has been really low because I've just been using the internal microphone. So I think there might be an app that I need to download. I'm probably not using this right. So these videos, the audio is probably gonna suck yet again until I figure out how to use this thing. So apologies, no need to leave a little bitchy comment letting me know that the audio sucks because I know, thanks. Sea Island Cotton, and this one, I don't know if it was Sea Island Cotton or, they have two cotton scents from Bath and Body Works that I used to love. I don't think it was a Sea My phone just abruptly cut me off again. I swear I'm working on getting 
all of the media off my phone and backed up in Google Photos, but right now it's pretty full. So I just had to delete a bunch of my food delivery apps because let's be honest, I'm not going to be using them anytime soon with the coronavirus going around or, you know, the, the takeout apps, whatever. Um, cause a lot of restaurants are not, they're having to close down and lay off employees. So anyways, I don't need those right now. So I'm gonna try and be really, really quick before it cuts me off again. All right. Where I left off was Sea Island cotton. Love it. Feeling good. I'm really into banana scented things. Bath and Body Works, uh, no, Body Shop has a banana lotion or body cream, body butter, whatever it's called that smells so good, but I didn't buy that this time. I have used it before, but it's been used up a long time ago. So this one says uh, creamy bananas, coconut, milk, and vanilla. And then the last soap from Bath and Body Works is has like a weird like matte finish I guess almost looks like there's something on it but anyways this is called Waikiki Beach Coconut and on the back it says dragon fruit water bamboo and coconut and jasmine that's not that sounds really good let's try to see if I can smell it like but I can't smell it through this all right so now I'm moving on to body shop Body Shoppy Body Butters are my favorite. Just my favorite lotion. I mean, I really like Hemp's for hand lotion, but the Body Shop Body Butters are amazing. Best smelling lotion I've ever had in my life is this one. And when I was working, I had this at my desk, and uh, Danny says it smells like Fruity Pebbles, but it is the most intense, amazing citrusy smell you've ever smelled in your life. Um, this is their Satsuma. And it is just, this is probably my, my, my most favorite smell in the whole world. I mean, you can see it looks really thick, but it's not super greasy. It's really, really moisturizing. The next body butter that I get, I pretty much buy two at a time. If they have the bigger tubs, these are the smaller tubs, but hello. <laughs> These are the smaller tubs, but um, I buy the bigger ones whenever I can because I go through this stuff pretty quickly. I think Strawberry has a bigger tub, but a lot of them only, this is as big as they come. But the next scent that I got is Coconut. And this smells like, I like directly went back to my childhood and it smells like a, a suntan lotion, but in the best way. Yeah, it just, it's, oh, it's like, it's the best smelling coconut. I mean, I feel like coconut, see how thick that is? I feel like coconut can be hit or miss. This is a good smelling coconut. Danny's changing the baby. I live in a small apartment, so you hear everything everywhere. It's basically one big box, so. I never tried their bar soap before, but I picked up three of them. And of course, I had to get the Satsuma because that's my favorite. And then I got the almond milk and honey. And then strawberry. The strawberry may be my second favorite scent that they have. It's very, very potent, but like in the best way. It's not overwhelming. It's just like very, very rich and if you've never had body shop soaps, or I mean, I've never tried their soaps, I hope they're good, but um, they just are the best smelling things in the world. I've pretty much said that a million times, but I can't say it enough. They're just amazing. Um, down to my last two things, and then I'm gonna be finally turning off the camera because it wants to come off on me anyway. I've been seeing people everywhere trying sheet masks, and I'm really, really late to the game. I know it's not anything new, but I've never tried one before. So I bought this sheet mask from Body Shop. I'm excited to try it. And then at the end of the order, they put in a free sample. And I got this little hand cream. So this is the Body Shop brand Hemp. It looks kind of similar to Hemp's, but I think that they're two different brands. I don't know if I'm wrong about that. 
that's my cue. Like, comment, and subscribe.